Giants quarterback Colin Kaepernick has been offered a challenge by a county police force. They want him to get a taste of the job he's been critical of, so they've invited him to attend the police academy. That would be the invitation coming from the Alameda County Sheriff's Office. Let's welcome J.D. Nelson, who is with us now. You issued, it's a kind of a challenge, isn't it, J.D.? You sort of said, hey, you're critical of the cops. Come and see how we do it. Do you think he's going to come and uh, accept the invitation? Well, we hope he does. Uh, we were more uh, interested in just getting a dialogue uh, with him. He, he's made claims about uh, profiling and, and his experiences, and we feel that we can learn from that, and uh, we know that he'll learn from us. Uh, so hopefully it just gets a good two-way dialogue going. Generally speaking, what's the reaction to, to cops like yourself? Because you're in a very, very liberal area of the country. I used to live there. It's about as liberal as you can get. How do the locals treat you? Well, we, we enjoy uh, uh, a very good treatment from, from our constituents uh, here. We're on the the east side of San Francisco and Alameda County. So Oakland is our county seat and uh, we enjoy uh, very good relations with, uh, with our county residents. Do you? No question. Really? We do. Yeah, we really do. Um, but we, so we work Kaepernick hard at it. So what's talking about? We well, he, he was speaking, in my opinion, in kind of general terms about the training of law enforcement and uh, it just coincided with uh, the first day of our 157th Academy. So you, you look at those young men and women that are coming into the, into the law enforcement profession and know what they've done to get there, to live their lives correctly, to be able to pass the, the test, to be able to pass a background, uh, to get one of those seats, seats in the academy, which goes about two out of a, out of a hundred get, get one of those seats. Mm. Uh, and for him to say that, we said clearly he doesn't know 100% uh, what he's speaking of, so why not have him come out here and and learn. No, when you issued that invitation, it was widely covered in the local media. What was the local reaction to your invitation to Kaepernick to come on and visit the academy? Well, we've had, you know, when we posted this on our Facebook, uh, this has gotten close to a million hits just in less than two days. So, and, a and the reaction. Hits. Good Lord, that's. Yeah. <laughs> You don't normally just, get that we're kind just shy of, hit, of a do million. You? <laughs> yeah, you guys will probably put us over the million mark, quite honestly. And uh, but we, you know, the the feedback has been nothing but positive because we're not being critical. We're just saying, hey, why don't you come out and, and learn, and and we'll learn from you, and, and you can learn from us. And we're not, you know, we're not chastising him. We're just saying, you know, are you going to be part of the solution, or are you just going to be okay. one of those? Monday morning quarterbacks that I've cast a, dispersions all the time. I, I, my dollar says that when Kaepernick starts on Thursday night in the last preseason game in San Diego, he'll be booed off the field. That's what my dollar says. Would you take the bet? <laughs> I would not take that You're bet. Right. I understand <laughs> it's, no, you it's, military, it's military appreciation exactly. day in San Diego, and uh, exactly. it's probably going to be a, a rough crowd. Hey, yeah. J.D., look, thanks very much for coming on board today. We do appreciate it, sir. Congratulations on a million hits to your website. That's pretty good. Thanks very much, sir.